Hey guys, how are you all doing? Now, quickly before this video starts, I know, again, but seriously, quickly before this video starts, I just wanted to say that I hope you all had a good year, because summer is coming up, many of you are having plans, and just in the comments below, leave what you're gonna do for the summer, but what I am gonna do for the summer is I'm gonna make, like, a live gameplay series. Now, I know that that should actually go on my gaming channel, but I kind of wanted to do it on this channel simply because, you know, just to reach out to you guys more, you know? But seriously, I really don't know what game I should do because I'm gonna like at least play an hour of it for a couple of days live streaming it. And I ju just in the comments below, what do you want to see? Do you want to see Need for Speed? Do you want to see GTA? Uh, do you want to see Hitman from start to <laughs> an hour? I don't know. Anyways, you guys leave it in the comments below, and I'll see if I could do it. And whoever comments more of it, then I guess that's what I'll be doing. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Have fun. Somebody once told me the world is gonna roll me. I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. Hello guys, how are all of you doing today? So today I have just remembered another story in which has happened in 7th grade. Now wait, I'm thinking it's 7th. No, this happened in 8th grade. Alright, so what happened is this was a spring break, right? And so we're all just ready and hyped up for a week of no school, no work, no worries, no nothing. And so everyone had their plans. I tried to keep in touch with my friends, but again, now that because I am a vegetable, <laughs> I'm a couch potato <laughs> who has nothing else to do with life, I just sat at home just doing whatever I possibly can, that just included computer games, TV, whatever. And of course, it went really fine, right? But this isn't the story of how my spring break went that time. This is the story of what happened after the spring break. <clears throat> so I was just... I just came back from to school from spring break. It felt extremely short, if only weeks actually did go that short uh, on days you actually have to be in school or work or whatever. But then immediately afterwards, I'm just talking to my friends because I really missed them. I didn't have any time to talk to them over the weekend because I was quote unquote busy. Alright, so then of course, as I'm just going through the normal day, just hoping it would pass really fast, just doing whatever I possibly can on my phone, trying to do everything to get that day to pass faster so I could finally get back home. I see a bunch of people gathering. They're just like a full hallway. And I thought that there was going to be a fight because that's legit the kind of gathering there was. But no, there was much more people. The entire school was there. And then, of course, my friend there just comes up to me and he's like, Hey dude, you gotta check this out. And apparently, during this spring break, what has happened is a bunch of people, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and guess at anarchists or something like that, I don't know have broken into classrooms, stolen a bunch of things that included computers and everything, and by broken, I'm not talking about just lockpicking the door or whatever. No, I'm talking legit rocks thrown at windows. Like, the windows there were shattered. They had to even be boarded up, and, like, there was glass everywhere, and I'm just standing there like, wow, that's, that's nice. And then my friend just is like, dude, 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 this isn't the worst. Uh, check what's inside the classroom now, because they let us go inside the classroom. Everything there was robbed. I mean, there was legit, like, spray-painted all over the place. Like, the demonic uh, upside-down pentacle thing. Like, upside-down crosses and stuff like that all over the place. And also, there was, like, dicks and stuff like that spray-painted all over the walls inside the classroom. Now, speaking of dicks... Uh, <laughs> oh my god. Uh, what has happened is... Also, around the school, uh, there was legit a bunch of everything all over there. There was, like, dicks spray-painted, like basically porn, porn <laughs> spray painted on there and then stuff uh like at this school like at this wall uh what else was there like legit on a wall there was written at this wall and also on like the ceiling it said that too and also it said f the principal except it said the principal's name also the entire ground was spray painted with like dicks and stuff like that and just a bunch of demonic things and whatever like it was just a demonic ritual going on at the school and everything was horrible there. Also, uh, as we went more towards the back of the school, there was a car crashed right into the classroom. 
uh, there was like glass all over the place. The car was obviously broken and couldn't move. And it was apparently the principal's car. And I'm just standing there like, wow. I'm over there just standing like half satisfied, yet half not satisfied. You guys know those feelings like when something horrible happens that you know you should feel bad for, but they're just so satisfying. Oh my god, I'm gonna sound like a psychopath right now. No, but seriously. <clears throat> it, like, everything there. My friend uh, over there just comes up to me and he's like, hey, 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 check this out. And apparently, the office, all the cameras, keep in mind, all the cameras were shot. Uh, and not, well, I'm pretty sure there were like BB guns or something like that because they have found lots and lots of BBs all over the place. But then what has happened is we go to the principal's office. Uh, you know like one of those little vault things that they keep in offices like you walk down the corridor because the school I'm currently at right now actually has one of those and inside there's like a bunch of important things like money and stuff like that and so apparently that has been broken oh yeah and keep in mind everything there was also broken that included computers the uh, computers glass doors the vault was actually broken into because, like, it's a giant titanium wall. You guys know what those are, like, almost like in banks, where they have those little vault things where you, like, keep, like, a bunch of money and stuff like that? It's something similar to this, except it's, like, pretty important information about the school, and, like, they do keep some money in there and stuff like that, and it was broken into. And almost everything there was stolen. And I'm actually going to leave it to last whether the thieves were caught or not. But keep in mind, so... Everything there was extremely horrible. There was like a bunch of gang sign, like gang things spray painted all over the stuff, all over the place. And then after I was uh, going to my class, right? We, as a matter of fact, didn't get to go in our classrooms because of how damaged they were, because of how broken they were, because like, like the computers and laptops and like, you know, one of those little smart board things, the one where you like pull it down and then a projector just <clears throat> flashes and you could like uh, learn off that, yeah. That was ripped. The stuff there was broken. Uh, there was a spray paint canister found, but apparently what has happened is they didn't find any fingerprints on it, which is actually quite satisfying. And also, oh my god, uh, what else was there? So remember the car that was there? If the car was legit spray painted, like FU principal and sort of a quote unquote V principal spray painted because it had like a not a stick figure, but like, the most simple drawn person with spray paint with the principal's name above him, with a giant dick in his mouth. <laughs> Apparently the people that done this really like dicks. Anyways, all jokes aside here, I'm just walking down the corridor like, with a giant smile on, on my face, yet I'm just thinking like, uh, what is even going on? And then, <laughs> oh my god, my friend then comes up to me, and he says, hey, you have not seen the big one. Now keep in mind, you know that all this is happening, right? All this uh, trash is happening, right? And all these seem bad. I'm gonna guess that <laughs> I'm right. Would you guys believe it if I told you that there was actually something worse? Alright. So apparently, there was like burns in school because they found gasoline there, like gasoline canisters. <clears throat> and part of the school burned down, which is way in the back where almost nobody goes. The school was gonna get burned down. And, uh, legit, there was like matches and stuff like that. There was gasoline canisters. Uh, the entire wall was black. Luckily, then, the uh, school w had little wood on it because otherwise it could have ended up a little more badly. But the entire football field was burned down. The dry grass around the football field, which is around the track, was burned down. And part of the school was burned down. And it wasn't really that big, it wasn't that big a deal, all they had to do was paint over it. And that was gonna be it, but... <clears throat> I'm just standing there watching, I did not take pictures because I just didn't want to. I'm like, you know what, I'm just gonna look at this. And just throw it back aside. But okay, and now since the ending of <laughs> this story, I am going to tell you whether the people were caught or not. The answer is no, they were not caught. <laughs> Wow, all this build up for quote unquote nothing. But yeah, they were never caught. At least that's what uh, everyone knows. No one talked about it. After what happened, people were just like talking about it to their friends and whatever. But everyone is keep on saying that even to this day, the people who did this were not caught. Although there were some people that were suspected of doing it. 
but there is no proof that they actually did it. There was like five people that were suspected for all this because like, uh, that some little things that led to them, but it ended up that it was not actually them, so yeah. But yeah, guys, this is another little story that I have had for today. I do hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did enjoy watching this video, leave a like. It's going to make my day a lot. And also, if you want to make my day even better, subscribe to the channel if you enjoy this kind of story content. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter also. And peace out.